Hey, Buff Nation, voice of the Buffs, Mark Johnson here, working our way towards September 2nd where the Buffs will open up the season at Folsom Field against TCU. want to introduce you to a new guy. Uh, he is transferred here from West Virginia, Josh Chandler Samita, linebacker for the Buffaloes. Welcome. It's good to be here. It's good to be here. Tell us a little about your, your journey. How did you become a Buffalo after starting your college career and having a great career at West Virginia? Sure, really just through connections. Uh, heard a lot of good things about Coach Wilson, a lot of good things about Coach Durrell, and I feel like this is the best decision for me coming out of the portal. And, and since you've gotten here, I'm, I'm assuming you're not disappointed. You like Boulder and what uh, it has to offer? Yeah, I like Boulder a lot. I like being around a bigger city, Denver. It reminds me of being back at home with Cleveland and in Akron. Of course, Columbus and Cincinnati. Yeah. So it's, it's been nice. Why transfer? I mean, you had such a great career at West Virginia, a very good football program. Why transfer? Uh, I spent my four years there. I, I felt like it was just time for something new. You're from Canton, Ohio. Now, that's the home of the Football Hall of Fame, right? You grew up there. You have to play football in Canton, Ohio, don't you? Yeah, it's, it's, it's ridiculous when football is like there. Like, like, we play our Little League games in the stadium. Before they, before they rebuilt it to make it to uh, Tom Benson, it was Foster yeah. Stadium. Played every single Little League game there my whole life. Oh, yeah, so it's kind of in your blood. Yeah. <laughs> Did you play any other sports? I played basketball, ran track. Okay. Yeah. Was football always your best sport, though? Yeah, basketball was my first love, though. Was basketball was my first love. I thought I was going to be 6'6", six, six, point guard, <laughs> something like that. It, it just ain't pan out like that. All right. you, you have athletes in your family? You come from a family of athletes? Yeah, I got a couple family members who made it to the NFL. Okay. Yeah. Tell us a bit about your background. You got a lot of brothers and sisters, big family, small family? I see. So I have five younger brothers, five blood brothers. I have a, uh, a god brother and a god sister. I'm the oldest of all of them. Yeah. And my, my actually, my youngest brother is like a year and a half, two years older than my daughter. Okay. Yeah. Unbelievable. So uh, a pretty competitive family out of match with all that, that many. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's pretty competitive. I have two that are literally like a year, like 11 months apart, and wow. they're the exact same. So what's been your take and your kind of read on this Buffs program since you got here? Definitely feel like it was a program that had talent but didn't really understand where the direction was. Like, for instance, defensively, I played on a lot of talented defenses, so I, I know what it looks like and so do the coaches. But really just being able to direct it and kind of give everybody the same vision, the same sight, was able to, was the, like the biggest thing. And we did that through the walkthroughs, through the practices over the summer. And now, like, we're starting to get into the camp, and it's like literally we were one or two pieces away. Like, for instance, when Nate went down, it kind of shot, it kind of basically shell shocked him. And yep. literally, you can go back to the film even when he was there, when he wasn't. It was the same defense. But you can literally pinpoint, okay, one or two plays here. And those are plays that good defenses make that these guys weren't really seeing yet, but now they see it. Josh, when you come in from the outside like you have and you got a year to play, is it tough to come in and lead or do you just jump in and say, hey, man, I've, I've been here. I know what it's all about. I know what football is all about. I'm going to you know, show you guys the way. I, I, I definitely for the first month kind of just laid back and just kind of kind of scoped the scene to see what it was like. I was blessed to be able to lead, be in a leadership role very early. I was a captain my sophomore year, so I was a three-year captain at West Virginia. So I knew what it looked like. I just kind of wanted to sit back, see what it was, and really just kind of pencil myself in wherever it was needed, but we have a lot of great leadership on the team. A lot of well, I'll tell you what, that, that season's going to start before we know it. Good luck this season. Hopefully. All right, Josh Chandler, Samito, new Buffalo at linebacker for the Colorado Buffaloes. They'll take on TCU September 2nd to open up the season. Uh, stop.